students today we are going to learn question and answers from the chapter our nervous system so let us immediately start with the first question which is tick the correct answer and the question reads our nervous system consists of the brain the spinal cord and the dash so as you can see from the picture over here what could be the answer well the answer is nose okay so let us take mark nose so this highlighted part over here from where you can see the signals going back and forth second question a person might faint if his heart does not send enough blood to his feet house kidneys brain what should be the answer well the answer is brain okay as you can see from the picture over here these are the different parts of the brain and if a person doesn't get a blood to his brain he might faint let us see next question when we happen to touch a hot object the sensory immediately passes message to the dash the options are brain hand spinal cord eyes what should be the answer the answer is spinal cord as you can see from the picture this particular organ okay inside this organ there is a spinal cord that runs through it and when we happen to touch a hot object the sensory nerves immediately passes signal to the spinal cord okay fourth question to clean a blocked nose we must inhale dash perfume eyes steam none of this so the picture itself makes it clear that it is a steam that should be inhaled if there is a blocked nose okay so let us tick mark steam our next question is write t for true and f for false and first in that list is the system that controls the other system is called the respiratory system and the answer to this question is f it is false statement the system that controls the other system is not called the respiratory system in fact it is nervous system second question the cerebellum coordinates the action of the muscles and makes them work together is it true yes it is true so you will write t third question the action controlled by the spinal cord are called reflex action true or false it is also true statement let us see fourth question the part of the brain that controls our senses is called cerebrum true or false it is true fifth question the motor now brings messages from sense organs to the brain or spinal cord i will repeat the motor nerves bring messages from sense organs to the brain or spinal cord true or false false okay so you'll write f the pupil is an opening in our eye through which light enters true or false this is a true statement and last true or false is the ears enable us to keep our balance true or false it is a true statement yes the ears along with the hearing it also helps us to keep our balance then next question complete the series in that the first one is bundles of fibers nose taste buds so bundle of fibers are nose taste buds the answer is tongue memory cerebrum heartbeat medulla then cerebellum muscles cerebrum sensory organs okay and eyes sight skin touch so these are the answers to complete the series write short answers the first question the brain needs a continuous supply of blood and oxygen why well brain needs a continuous supply of blood and oxygen because it is like fuel for brain and if it doesn't get the supply a person might faint so remember students that our body also needs fuel just like any other vehicle and which is that part of our body that provides fuel our heart our heart provides the fuel to our body in the form of blood in blood there is a food that is required by every organ including brain so blood acts like a fuel for our body next question what are sensory nerves well sensory nerves are the nerves that transmit signals to the brain from all the senses then next question third question how is our brain protected from injuries well brain is enclosed within the skull also between the skull and the brain there is a clear fluid which acts like a cushion and protects it from injuries fourth question what could happen if we clean our ears with a pointed object well if we try to clean our ears with a pointed object 
it can cause injury to eardrum so we should never clean our ears with pointed object fifth question what is reflex action the action which are done automatically without thinking are called reflex action next is answer these questions in this there will be some long answers also what does the nervous system consist of well our nervous system consists of the brain the spinal cord and the nerves second question name the different parts of the brain what work does each part do well our brain is made up of three main parts first is cerebrum it controls the working of our eyes ears nose and tongue it is also controls our voice it is a center of intelligence i repeat it controls the working of our eyes ears nose and tongue it also controls our voice it is a center of intelligence cerebellum it coordinates the action of the muscles and makes them work together it helps us to balance our body also then third part is medulla it connects the brain to the spinal cord it controls the involuntary actions like movement of lungs or heart then third question what are nerves and what are their functions well nerves are structures similar to long threads that carry signals between the brain and other parts of the body i repeat nerves are structures similar to the long threads that carry signals between the brain and other parts of the body it is responsible for transporting messages to all the body parts fourth question how does body test if we have a blood well food does not test good when we have cold because our nose is blocked and food tastes better when we can smell it okay students then comes fifth question which is the last question for the day how can you keep your skin healthy here you should write soap and water are enough to remove dirt and sweat from the skin dry yourself thoroughly after bathing and wear clean and comfortable clothes a scratch or a cut on the skin should be treated with an antiseptic lotion to prevent infection okay students so this is how we can keep our skin healthy students if you have any questions feel free to ask you can put your questions in comment box thank you for attending this session see you during next session with a new topic until then take care bye bye